Tarzan of the Apes from the novels by Edgar Rice Burroughs. With Mr. James H. Pierce as Tarzan and Miss Joanne Burroughs as Jane Porter. This is an American Goldfield production directed by James Knight Carden and released by the World Broadcasting System and Associated Stations. Tarzan has returned to his jungle because he is unable to understand the code of the whites which would allow one of them to shoot him after he has befriended them and saved them from the jungle dangers. Word is brought to him, however, that Jane Porter has been taken aboard a pirate ship. Tarzan swims to the rescue, gains Jane's cabin aboard the ship, and when the pirates are beginning to sail, he nearly wrecks the ship by lassoing the helmsman. Now, are you ready? Hold your breath. Call us. Call us, Miss Bob. Grab onto that ruddy wheel. I've got my flight, but I can't see anything. Oh, the poor. Get her over. Get her over, can't you? Hear the roar of them breakers? Oh, the poor to this. And keep your tank civil. I'll knock your blasted ears down with a belayin, Jim. If you ask me back here. Ah, uh, pipe down and get your ship to ride. Sunky! Hey, Sunky! Well, I saw. Shut your anchor, darling. We'd better look below and see everything is sound before we start off. All right, sir. Let's have a live here. What happened, Carlos? I don't rightly know. It's so dark it was hard to make out anything. First thing I know, the old tubs are bouncing about like a squaw. Something must have had Harry. Wow. It was at a way. Funny business, that's what it is. Hi there! Give us a light here, you swab. Hey, let me tell you something, Snipes. You may be the boss here right now, but you can't talk to me like I was a dark rat, and you better remember it. Ah, oh, forget it. Uh, I was riled up, I was. Yes, you was riled up. And what about? The ship keeling over. Fine master mariner you are. Keep your head. That's what you better do if you ever expect to see Liverpool or London again. All right, all right. I take back what I said. Where's that quartermaster with that wheel? Here's your light. Oh, God, blind look. It's Eric. He was at the wheel. Strike me pink. He's been done in. Uh, his neck has been broken. Oh, so true he was. Look, look at the marks on his neck. Looks to me like he'd been hanged. Them rope marks. And what about Bill and Jonesy? I can below to have a look at that dime. All hands below. We'll see what's what. All hands. You're afraid to go yourself, eh, Snipe? Ah, screw your cab, car. <laughs> Jane, Jane? Oh, Tarzan, I was just frightened. I thought the ship was going to go over. Tarzan, stop ship. No go away now. Yes, you did. I never saw anything happen so quickly. Now, we go away. All Tom and Ganny go below. Oh, Tarzan, I'm almost afraid to jump into that dark water. It's so black. Dark. Night better. Tom and Ganny not see us now. Yes, you're right. Let's go this way. Tarzan. Yes, Jane? Curse me. I've forgotten all about the captain. We can't leave him here to these, these pirates. Tracy, tall man? Yes. Oh, I know, Tarzan. We ought to get off the ship while we have this chance. But after all, I feel that it's partly my fault that Tracy is, is a prisoner. When Tom and Ganny come above again, we go below. All right. But well, what's the matter? What are you sniffing like that for? Pretty soon, big wind comes. A storm? Like before, at hut. Rain, thunder, lightning. A little more, same here. Out here where we can they are the same as Harry. It beats me. There weren't no one there but the dame. And she can't have done it. And she can't have got a lot. Why, the dame didn't kill Bill and Josie. They look more like they'd be manhandled by a gorilla. Strike me pink. A gorilla, you said. Quite logical, but, but maybe... Why, what are you thinking about? The jungle's look. Quite reasonable to suppose that he's aboard, but if he is... I tell you, he's a human gorilla. Ah, oh, go on. You are always hopping on that jungle guy, Snipe. I tell you, I've seen him. And our lives ain't worth a blooming quid till we get him, if he's a boy. Well? Carlos, 
You take your gun and you go below and you hunt Oh, your... not me. I'm not hunting gorillas. You men are otherwise below decks in the middle of the night. What's this? Mutiny? Call it whatever you like. When I go hunting, I take company. <laughs> On shore, Darno, Clayton, and the others put the finishing touches to the small boat which they've been repairing. I think she's about ready, Darno. Yes, I think we shall have to risk it. Yes, yes. That shouting that we heard from the ship. I'm afraid that Tarzan and Jane were discovered. I, I, I wish it were daylight. I, I'm not afraid. Uh, but to go out to that ship at dead of night... Oh, it is unpleasant, monsieur, but safer. And in the dark, we can get much closer. Uh, that is true. I, I did not think of that. Thunder! Another rainstorm coming up. Uh, worse than that, I fear. A hurricane! And from off the sea, too. Look! See the white flag, even in the dark. Not a pleasant outlook in this cockle shell of a boat. Mm, I know, it's not that I am. Fear I must reverse what I said about taking Monsieur Philander with us. Madano, even if I can't row, I can bail. But, Monsieur, we cannot take the professor in such weather as I know is coming. I say no more. I am determined to go. Uh, so be it, monsieur. I think then we are ready. Now, keep the boat on the port this side as we push her into the water. Ready? Uh, you too, King. what a night this is to be. Yes, I'm not in love with it myself. But we can't leave Jane out there another minute. And Tarzan. Oh, the storm. Here she comes. I told you all. You, Monsieur Le Professor, no need to get your feet wet now. Get into that boat. Oh, very well. And you too, King. Take an oar. No, oh, get in. As sure as I'm standing here, I'll kill you. All right, all right. Are there any cake on? Yes, already. Then, into the water with her. Right. Oh, no. Little more. Oh, a bit better. Oh, oh, On board the ship, Tarzan and Jane stand hidden behind the hood of the companionway while Snipes and his crew argue about going to look for them. Jane? Yes? Now, go below. Yes, while they're fighting among themselves. This way, Tarzan. I know my way about on this ship. I spent many weary weeks aboard us. We need even a break in the door of Captain Tracy's cabin when there are long rolls of thunder like that one. Yes. I'm and Ganny above. Not here too much. Here's the person's strong room. Captain Tracy? Yes. Are you all right? Yes. Tarzan killed a man at the wheel and the ship got out of control. Yes, I know. I heard Snipes and the rest talking about it. By the way, one of the men you killed, Harry, had the key to this strong room. Then it may be lying about in the boat? Yeah, it's possible. It's a large key all by itself on an iron wire. I look at the cabin I was in. Come, Tarzan. What do you want, Jane? I can't, Tarzan. To unlock the door. Oh, if only I had a light groping its way on the floor. Oh, what, what's this? Oh, I believe it is a key. Captain Tracy, I found the key. I hope it's the right one. Quick, Tarzan, your knife. Cut the captain's rope. Good, Jane. Open quick. No noise. I, I don't know how to thank you. I never expected to get off this ship alive. We don't know that we will yet. No, but to be free, even for a moment. Rope. Oh, cut. Uh, thanks, old man. Here's the gun, Captain. I took two from the men we, uh, Tarzan, killed. Have you a gun, Tarzan? No, they don't give it, Captain Tracy. Tarzan doesn't understand guns. I see. Well, if we can get to my cabin, then there ought to be plenty of shells there. Carmen Ganny, come again. Look for Jane. Tarzan. Yes, we'll have to get out of here. All right, follow me. We'll try my cabin first. When Carmen Ganny come below, we go over into water. Swim. Good heavens, man. Not in this weather. Why, you'd never reach the shore. You don't know Tarzan. He's like a fish in the water. Uh, perhaps he is, but I know you can't make it. I couldn't swim to shore myself, and I'm a strong swimmer. Tarzan, take Jane. All right. Captain. Uh, with all due respect to Tarzan's ability as a swimmer, uh, you wait until you see the water. Here's my cabin. Close it behind you, Tarzan. I don't want them to see a light. No matches. Oh, here we are. Ah, 
Here, Miss Porter. In this drawer are plenty of cartridges. Thanks, Captain. We'll get her all rigged up. Then we'll see what's what. Yes. I'd be much better with some light playing around. <sighs> We're going to rig up the searchlight on the bridge. Then we'd better get out of your cabin. It's so close to the bridge. Yes. And pray that they don't come in here on their way. Careful on the deck. It's all slippery with the wash from the scuppers. These pirates have let this ship get into an awful state. Oh, what's that? Quick, it's the searchlight. Light gone now. Yes, yes, it'll take him a few seconds to get it rigged properly. Go behind here? Yes, we'll make for the wheelhouse. Come on, follow me and keep in the shadow. Oh, that light! There she goes! Making for the stern! Oh, they picked me up! Wait, Captain! Mr. Potter, you put that reflector out of use for good. Now, get ready. Oh, Tom and Ganny, come. Yes, but at least they don't have that searchlight. Oh, you watch me. What are you doing? Stop, Captain. It's so dark, I can hardly see. Yes, yes, I can, no. Merciful heavens, he's loosening the guy that holds the derrick pool. What will that do? Quiet ways, Tons. Quick, get out of here. Snipes is going to let go of that guy, and when it comes down... Smash this wheelhouse like that's work. Have Jane, Tracy, and Tarzan escaped from that wrecked wheelhouse? How can they win safely from the ship? And what of Darno?